And guys, it's time for another tournament. This time, it's of the Bundesliga collect collection. And by Munich, the current holders are going to be fighting for the trophy because the tournament we're going to be doing is the DFB Pokal Cup, a.k.a. the German Cup. Let's get straight into it, guys. Right, guys, so we are back with another tournament. Um, last time out, I did the Champions League tournament, and I will be doing another Champions League tournament, guys, when this tournament is running as well. So loads of tournaments coming up, because I've got a box and a half of the Champions League, and I've got 50 packs of these Bundesliga, Bundesliga cards. But as you can see by the title, this is the first uh, part, the first episode, the first bit of the tournament and yes as you heard by the theme song which i never knew they actually had that core of a theme song but that is the dfb pakel cup theme song so yeah um and that's what they will be fighting for in this tournament it's the dfb pakel cup if i'm pronouncing that right the german cup pretty much the fa cup or the carabao cup of england pretty much guys and the holders of course are by munich but in real life they got knocked out by kiel in penalties which is madness which kiel uh, Team in Bundesliga 2, but they're top of their league, pretty much, guys. But yes, guys, um, I left a poll yesterday on if you want Bundesliga 2 teams in this tournament or Bundesliga 2 teams out of this tournament. Um, if you want to in, it means that I can only do one of these tournaments instead of two. But if you want them out, it means that I can do two. And you guys, mo more of you guys voted out just about. Okay, so I will be able to do two of these DFB Pokal Cup tournaments okay guys as you guys wanted Bundesliga 2 cards out so if you see any Bundesliga 2 cards I'm going to go um, just get rid of them because um, yeah they are not in this tournament it's only Bundesliga teams so yeah without further ado let's get straight into it and let's pick the teams guys we'll jumble all, all up and I'll, I'll tell you how this is going to work right guys so without further ado let's get going with the teams so let's put all these teams to one side of teams in the Champions League and Europa League They'll be coming in tomorrow, guys. And yeah, let's just um, fold all these up like so and we'll get picking, shall we? And we will see um, what teams will be playing against each other. It will be very interesting. Of course, there are some teams in this collection from um, last year, like Paderborn, who got relegated, and Dusseldorf, who got re relegated last year, guys. Um, but yeah, this is the collection of the 2019-20 season. And as I'll say again, there are Bundesliga 2 cards in there, but we are not counting them this time. Round, guys. So, yeah, without further ado, let's get straight into it. And here we go, guys. Let's go. So, randomly picking here. So, the first team up is... Here we go. It is Freiburg. So, sorry, they're so small. Freiburg. So, they're the first team up, guys. And who will they be playing against? I'll put the numbers up at the top in a minute, guys. And they'll be playing against... Here we go. Oh, wow, what a game this is going to be. Wolfsburg. Obviously, they're the favourites out of these teams, I reckon. Um, but, yeah, Freiburg are a decent side in the Bundesliga, if you don't know, guys. They are a very good side. So, um, yeah, I wouldn't underestimate Freiburg. So, yeah, Freiburg versus Wolfsburg for the first game. Let's get straight into the second one here. So, the second team out. Here we go. And it's going to be, who is home? It is Frankfurt, a very good German side, of course. And leaving the comment section down below, guys... What German side do you support? I like uh, Werder Bremen. They're my favourite. And pick it out for the um, second team in this second match. Um, here we do have Schalke. What a game that's going to be. Of course, struggling in real life. But still a huge side, Schalke. And it's Frankfurt Schalke in that game. Wow, what games we've got so far. I'm so excited for that game. Let's see who's going to get through. But now let's get straight into the next game. Which is the third game of this tournament. And we do have here, next up we have got Augsburg here, quite a poor side to be fair. And they'll be playing against, none of the teams have got the relegated sides yet. And they'll be playing against Union Berlin, the newly promoted side, who are actually doing very well this season. They're actually in fifth place, so they're doing incredibly well this season for them. Superb. So yeah, that should be a win for Union Berlin, but who knows. This is the cup. You never know in cups, guys, obviously. So, next up, guys, for the fifth game. No, fourth game. So, I don't know why I said fifth game. For the fourth game, that's what I want one about. We've got Werder Bremen. Yes, my side there. There they are. Well, I say my side, my favourite side. And they will be playing against... Here we go. They'll be playing against... Oh, they are playing against the relegated side, Paderborn, who finished bottom of the league. So, yeah, very, very nice. 
And now let's get straight into the last four teams here. And we'll pick this one here. Oh, I've got two, so we'll, we'll pick this one here. Oh, I've got, got it stuck in my hand. So we'll pick this one here. Here we go, guys. And it's going to be Cologne, who are struggling this season. And they will be playing against... Who will they be playing against? Mains who are struggling as well. They have joint bottom with Schalke there. And the last two teams is... We do have here... Who is it, guys? I think it's Hertha Berlin, isn't it? Hertha Berlin against the other relegated side, which is Dusseldorf. There they are, guys. Dusseldorf. So, yes, they are the games. Let's get straight into it. Without further ado, and let's get the numbers up. And let's get it all spread out. And let's get going. Right, so every t every team set up, guys, as you can see, we've got 50 packs here. So we'll pick one pile, one for uh, the second tournament of this. But this is the main part we're going to use today um, in, well, in this tournament, guys, pretty much. So, yeah, um, obviously 25 packs in each tournament. So these can be put to one side. We'll chuck them up there. And here are the packs. As you can see, Europa League and Champions League cards are um, out the way for now, guys. So up here, we've got Freiburg versus Wolfsburg. Um, game two here, we have Frankfurt versus Schalke, the game to look out for, guys. Game number three, we have Augsburg versus Union Berlin. Game number four, we've got Werder Bremen against uh, Paderborn. Number five, we have uh, Cologne versus Mainz. And number six, we have Hearth Berlin versus Dusseldorf. And is there any German fans? Is there any um, people from Germany? Leave a comment section down below and leave your teams, of course. I said my favourites, Werder Bremen. Um, but yeah, I've never seen this collection, never opened them. I had a look yesterday um, to see what the cards look like and what what were in the packs um and yeah so that's how i knew there was bundesliga two cards but let's pick five um packs guys so one two three four five so five packs we've got these off ebay guys if you're wondering if you want to go and buy some yourself and i think you can get these off tops website as well i think these are the german version though so here's the pack design very very nice five cards per pack guys Bundesliga and Bundesliga 2, only five cards, which is a shame. But still a very nice collection, 2019-20 season. And on the front, we've got uh, Brzezinski there. We've got uh, Julian Green, uh, Lewandowski, Sancho. That looks like Pontus Janssen, but I know it's not. And uh, Ginter, superb defender, of course. And they've all got the same picture pack design, as you can see there. Um, and the odds there, you can't read German, I can't read German, but you probably know, guys. Match winners are man of the matches, of course. 100 clubs. Um... Club badges, star players, and base cards, I guess. So, yeah, without further ado, let's get straight into it. Let's, I really want to see 100 clubs, see what 100 clubs are in the collection, because I haven't seen any. Um, so, yeah, all Bundesliga 2 cards don't count, so there might be quite a few draws, who knows. But let's get straight into it, guys, and let's see if we can get the first goals. Here we go. So, straight into this first pack. We'll leave that pack for my merchandise, and um, we'll pull it over there. And, yeah, you get a code in every pack, it looks like. Um, it's all German, so I don't really know. Oh, it's like a leaflet. Very nice. That's cool. Well, we'll put that to one side. And, oh, look at these cars. They look beautiful. So, first up, guys, Union Berlin have got their first goal, of course, in the Bundesliga. And it's Sebastian Polter there with the first goal. Very, very nice. Love the car design. Superb. We've got a shiny as well. I don't know if you get a shiny in every pack. But it's the first goal there. And it's for Union Berlin. And they're playing against Augsburg. Um, so, yeah, 1-0 Union Berlin. Great start for them in this tournament. Next up, we've got another goal. And this time, it's in the big game against Frankfurt and Schalke. It is Frankfurt's goal. And it's Torre here with the goal. Very, very nice to put Frankfurt 1-0 up in this DFB Pokal Cup round one, I guess. Next up, we do, in fact, have a Bundesliga 2 card, as you can see up there. And it's from Hedenheim. And it's um, Deutsch. Or Dortch, I'm not sure how to pronounce it. They could have went up last season if Werder Bremen didn't beat them in the playoff, relegation playoffs, but still a very nice card. Um, next up, we have, um, oh, it's a shame, Britschen, Richard and Gladbach's midfielder, Christian Kramer here, but of course, they are not in the um, in the tournament today. They'll be in tomorrow. And the shiny we do have, what's a pull this is, and Paderborn have taken a shot clean against my favourite team, Werder Bremen. And it's a man in a match car. Look at this. It's Marlon Ritter here. What's a car this? I might need to get more of these. These are beautiful cars. Look how nice purple design that is. And it's put... I know the back, by the way. Very, very nice looking. It's put Paderborn 1-0 up against Werder Bremen, the relegated side. But obviously not in this um, 
tournament, I guess. So anyway, guys, let's get straight into it. So that's a shock lead there. Um, but yeah, what, what, what a collection. I'm loving this. You know, Germany, you're really lucky to have this really good cards. Prime well, unit midfielder, it's not going to count, but it might be a 100 club or it might just be a base. I'm not sure. Um, or not, not even a shiny. And Paderborn have made it 2 0. And it's Christopher. Christopher. Are we. Oh, God. Antoui Aji. Aji. <laughs> From Paderborn. He made it 2 0 to Paderborn there. Absolutely incredible. Um, scenes there. Paderborn 2 0 up against Werder Bremen. And we do carry on with the scenes because it's the other relegated side, Dusseldorf, who gets their first goal, goal of the um, DFB Pokal Cup round one. And it's Kalnaki there with the goal. Wow, I'm sh not sure how to pronounce all these names. It's quite hard to see the um, names as well. But it's put them 1 0 up against Hertha Berlin. So some real shocks so far, guys. But Hertha Berlin have instantly bounced back and got the equaliser. And it's Gelderbred there <laughs> of uh, Hertha Berlin. I knew, know he is. I know I butchered his name, but yeah, um, whatever. But it's made um, Hertha Berlin get straight back into this game, and it's 1 0. And Augsburg have got their goal this time, and it's 1 0. They've got the equaliser against Union Berlin, and it's their goalkeeper, Luth, there. Very, very nice. Let's put um, Augsburg 1 0 up. A uh, one all, I mean, I should say. And it is a base pack. You are going to get base packs because there are only five cards per packet. But it's a very nice card. It's a, it's the um, Bayern Munich midfield, even though he's a left back. It's Alfonso Davies. Very, very nice card. That is really, really nice. Um, and yeah, that is that, guys. So now let's get straight into the third pack. What a um, tournament has been so far. F Freiburg and Wolfsburg a close game. And Kelowna mains as well. Um, but yeah, not surprised there. Let's get straight into it. And none of these teams want to be knocked out straight away. It's your Dortmund midfielder. And it's a shiny as well. Very nice. Excited to see who this is. So that's another code. Um, and let's go straight into it. And Union Berlin have their second goal. And it's Florian Flecker here with the goal for Union Berlin. That's made it 2-1 now. Um, against Augsburg there. A very, very big goal for Union Berlin. And there's been a break. Um, what's, what's it called? Not a dead, Not a deadlock. It's been a break in the system here, guys, we'll say. And there's been a goal, and it's broken the deadlock, I should say, in um, Game 5. And it's Mainz's striker, Marteta, here. Such a, such a good player he is. If you haven't watched him in the Bundesliga, go and watch him, guys. He's insane. He's made Mainz go 1-0 up against Cologne. A massive goal. That's a really nice card. I really like that. Next up, we have a Bundesliga 2 card. See how many we get? Not many. This is the second one. We have um, Wall here from um, Kiel, we're actually not Bayern Munich out in real life. Um, next up, we have Bayer Leverkusen's Dra Dragovic there. Um, but obviously not in the tournament for now. And the shiny we do have... Oh my goodness, guys! Jadon Sancho, 101 club. Well, 100 club. 101, 101 from Bayer Borussia Dortmund. Obviously not in the tournament. But what a point. Look at that for a design. My goodness, guys. Oh my god, that is insane! What a pull, guys! 101, 101 for the first opening has been—it's insane, really, guys, isn't it? So we still find a goal in the Freiburg Wolfsburg game, match day one. But yeah, um, what, what, a, what a pull! That's mad. But now let's get straight into this third, uh, fourth pack, second to last pack, um, and it's getting close now. It looks like we have a badge card here, which will be very handy for um, when I. Obviously, put, you won't need to see the names. You can just put the badge out, guys, pretty much. So there is the code. And badges don't count, by the way. Um, but Schalke have managed to find the equaliser. And it's Mark Oof with the goal there. That's uh, made it 1-1 there against Frankfurt. in a brilliant, brilliant test of two teams there. Very, very nice. And Hertha Berlin have turned it round against Dusseldorf. And it's Mittelstadt here with the goal for Hertha Berlin. That's made it 2-1. So a massive goal for Hertha Berlin to maybe get them through to round two there. There's another team in Bundesliga 2 here, guys. It's Nuremberg's Robin Hack there. I think he's actually gone somewhere else now. But yeah, he's a good player, he is. But yeah, a very nice card anyway. Next up, we have um, Wolfsburg. And it's finally broken the deadlock. And it's Weghorst there, the 84 Rated um, striker there with the goal. And he's a brilliant striker. Tottenham wanted him, in fact. That's made it 1-0. It's broken a deadlock in game one there. And the badge card is Frankfurt's badge. And wow, look at that. That's a beautiful looking card. And if Frankfurt get through, 
I'll be using that in the um, collection, guys, um, in this series. So very, very nice looking card that is. And there we are, guys. So now straight into the last pack. And it's, well, there's only one deadlocked game so far, Frankfurt and Schalke. So that might be going to a pole, who knows. But yeah, what a pull. That Strain and Sancho, still can't believe it. I can't open this pack. And it's Wolfsburg. So, oh my God, Wolfsburg might have actually won it here. So here's the code there. And Schalke have done it. Surely they've done it. And it's the youngster, Benito Raman here with the goal for Schalke to make it 2-1 against Frankfurt. Great. So I don't think that Frankfurt badge is going to be used. And they've turned it around in that game. It's 2-1 Schalke now. Um, and Werder Bremen get a big goal and a goal back against Paderborn. Can they get on the fight back there? It's Augustinsson with their goal. Um, the uh, Swede there. Very, very nice. Werder Bremen's first goal of the tournament, but looking to be knocked out. Uh, next up, we've got a Bundesliga 2 card of um, Dursen of um, Darmstadt. Next up, we have Stindl here of um, Brutschi, Much and Glab, who are not in it. And last not least... We have any other base pack, but it's Maximilian Arnold for Wolfsburg that's made 2-0 against Freiburg. And guys, I'm very happy about this because there is no poll. We actually have winners in every single game. I think it's the first ever time this has happened, guys. So let's use one. That's the game for round one. So guys, that is it for round one of the DFB Pokal Cup. Now let's see who gets through to round two. I'm obviously a massive cup for all these teams. It'd be nice to see an underdog get to the final or get finals competition. But yeah, in match one, guys, it's Freiburg nil, Wolfsburg two. So Freiburg have been knocked out. So they're at the competition, but Wolfsburg have gone through with two goal goals. So Wolfsburg are through. Game two, guys, it's Frankfurt one, Schalke two. So two away wins in a row there, um, which is massive, of course, for Schalke. And Frankfurt have unbe unbelievably been knocked out straight away, but against a Schalke side. So, I mean... That isn't too bad. It's a shame to see a big team go out so early on. In game three, we have another away, uh, away win, guys. It's Augsburg 1, Union Berlin 2, or Union Berlin 2 there. So, yeah, very, very nice for Union Berlin. Augsburg gone. I'm going to try and get some um, La Liga cards and some Serie A cards, and maybe more of these, because um, I like to see a tournament on them as well. Maybe the Coppa Italia and the um, Coppa del Rey or something. And, yeah, Union Berlin are through there. In match day four... It's another away win. It's another 2-1 away win. It's Werder Bremen 1, Paderborn 2. Paderborn get through. My favourites, Werder Bremen, get knocked out there. And Paderborn um, get through with the man and the match card. Still can't believe that beautiful card there. Um, but yeah, makes it um, through to the next round there. Fair play to Paderborn. In match 5, we have Cologne 0, Mainz 1. So scraping through with another away win. Cologne with the only team with no goals in today's a video and yeah, Mateta of course um, gets gets uh, mains food, but they always rely on them in real life as well. And in match day six, Hertha Berlin two, Dusseldorf won the only home win there. So congratulations to Hertha Berlin for um, getting the home win, and commiserations to Dusseldorf there. But Hertha Berlin are through, guys. So that is it, guys. I hope you enjoyed the video. We're going to be bringing in the Europa League and the Champions League teams, except for Dortmund and Bayern Munich. So the um, the tournament's going to get a bit more saucy, a bit more fiery, guys. But yeah, I hope you enjoyed it. Please smash the like button, subscribe down below. Let's try and hit 10 likes, guys, for the brand new series. And I'll see you guys later. Goodbye. And still can't believe this collection. It's a beautiful collection, but look at this card. What a pool that is. Wonderful. And he's English as well, which it makes it even better.